An off-duty police officer shot and killed by a fellow cop in East Harlem. Police believe it was a case of mistaken identity. Fox 5's Linda Schmidt is live this morning at the scene along 125th Street with more. Linda, what happened? Yeah, good morning there, guys. Well, I can tell you this right at the top here. This is nothing short of tragic, and this is still a very active crime scene. Take a look right here behind me, because police are still out here investigating early, early this morning. This happened about 10.30 last night. They're trying to piece together everything that happened. But like I said from the top, this is really nothing short of tragic. We're talking about a police officer, just 25 years old, just two years on the job. He had left work, just gotten off of work. Within minutes, he was shot, and less than 45 minutes later, he was pronounced dead. I heard seven gunshots. I looked over my roof and I just saw all the police. I saw two people running. Residents in this neighborhood in East Harlem say the scene was chaotic. Gunshots echoing in the night about 1030 that ended with the tragic death of 25-year-old police officer Omar Edwards. I'm like, man, where's that coming from? So then I see all these cop cars just come going all over the place and you know, then I walk over here and then I see that all the, all, all the roads are being blocked. Police Commissioner Ray Kelly says Officer Edwards, who worked in the Housing Bureau on East 124th Street, had just gotten off work when he spotted a guy breaking into his car. He says Officer Edwards struggled with the suspect who got away. The officer then apparently drew his gun and chased the suspect along East 125th Street. That's when an anti-crime team in plain clothes driving by spotted the chase. And one of those officers jumped out of the car. One of the officers, after exiting the vehicle, fired six times from his 9mm Glock, striking Officer Edwards twice. The bullet struck Officer Edwards in the left arm and in the chest. Officer Edwards was also in plain clothes, and because he was off-duty, he was not wearing a bulletproof vest. Commissioner Kelly says Edwards never fired his gun. Now the investigation will focus on whether the shooting officer identified himself as a police officer before firing, and if Officer Edwards identified himself as a cop. Officer Edwards is black, the shooting officer is white. We're obviously still trying to determine precisely uh, what happened. It's too early to say at, at this juncture. Uh, we're interviewing uh, the non-shooting officers, uh, as I said, trying to determine precisely what happened. Rest assured, we will find out exactly what happened here. All right, now once again, just to reiterate for you, Officer Edwards has been on the job for just two years. The shooting officer has been a police officer for four and a half years. And Officer Edwards, he had just gotten married and he has two young children. So again, Reed, a tragedy here. And of course, our hearts go out to that officer's family.